Hey, good morning. Welcome to week two of our e-learning online stuff. So um, hope that you're doing well. And uh, if you have any questions for me about the week one assignment or about anything at all, send me an email. A um, couple of announcements before we get going. Um, I'll be having a Google Meet later on today. So that'll be at 9 o'clock, 9 a.m. this morning. If you would like to touch base directly with me and also get a chance to see some of your classmates, I encourage you to go on to Google Meet. Um, the details about how to access that meeting are on Classroom. There's a link for the optional Google Meet. Um, go there and then, um, again, I, I will see you um, later on today. That's an optional thing. But um, if you have any questions, that might be a chance for you to, or that is a chance for you to address those with me. Um, also, a reminder about late work. Uh, this is the last week that I will accept uh, late work. So if you have anything that you haven't submitted from the third quarter or even from the first and second quarter, you need to submit that uh, this week. Originally, I said the 14th, which is today. Um, but if you get it to me by the end of the week, I'll still be able to get it in. Uh, the, I need to submit the, those grades by Friday. Um, so if you get it to me before the end of the week, I'll still be able to get those in. So if you have anything from the third quarter or even from the first and second quarter, you still have a chance to submit those. If you do submit something, make sure that you go on to Google Classroom. There's a late work form. Submit the late work form. That alerts me that you've submitted something. So make sure you get that in. Okay, so on to this week's work. So if you click on to the um, Here We Aren't So Quickly assignment, that brings up um, an overview of what we're doing this week. For the logical fallacy uh, work, if you haven't, um, that work is due now. So if you have not submitted the logical fallacy assignment, today is the last day that I'll accept that. So make sure that you get that in. Uh, we'll be doing a wrap up with that next week. Uh, where you'll have a chance to look at each other's work and also give um, some feedback um, to each other. And you'll get a chance to take a look at other fallacies other than just the fallacy that, that you looked at. So as I said, on to this week's assignment. Uh, an overview of the assignment is here. Basically, what you're going to be doing is reading the short story. It's an avant-garde uh, short story. Here we aren't so quickly. Um, it jumps through Time, it jumps through um, a person's life as he reflects on um, his relationship with his wife and with his family, and it's over an undisclosed expanse of time. So it's over over a long time period. Really fascinating and interesting. Brings up ideas about um, love, fate, and free will, friendship, family, identity, um, and. It really is thought provoking and we'll take a look at that short story and also at a couple of other videos and we'll kind of weave them all together. Um, so this week's assignment overview, uh, there, this first page has details about the assignment and basically goes over things that I just discussed. But this week, there are a couple of activities. First of all, you'll need to read Here We Aren't So Quickly, which I have linked um, at this site. So make sure that you pick that up. And then there's a um, short story assessment, which is um, a Google quiz um, that is on um, the story. So take a look at that and go through those. It's not too long. Also, there's an interview by the author, Jonathan um, Saffron Foer, who uh, talked about his writing process and specifically writing the difference between writing fiction and nonfiction. And it's an interesting um, watch. So take a look at that uh, interview. And then also there is um, a philosophical video inquiry um, by Sky Cleary. And he talks about love. Uh, and um, again, thought-provoking, interesting stuff, and addresses some of the same themes that are in Here We Aren't So Quickly. So take a look at that um, philosophical video inquiry. And then the last thing is there are a number of open-ended questions that I would like you to address. So fill out this open-ended question form that's linked here, and then submit that. Um, we're going to, you're going to have a chance to connect with your 
classmates next week, um, both about this assignment and also about the fallacy assignment. So next week will be kind of a wrap up of both week one and two. So th those things are coming up. Um, make sure that you submit this by next Tuesday. So that'll be Tuesday, April 21st. If you have any questions, um, send me an email. I'd be happy to help you out. Um, and again, I have a Google Meet that's scheduled for later on this morning. And um, I would love to see you and hear how you're doing. And again, if you have any questions, if I don't know the answer, I can point you in the right direction. I'm sure I can find out someone who can help you. So um, I guess that's it. So take care. And again, I hope that you're doing well and I will be in touch soon.